Yeah, I love unwrapping stuff. Like a present. Like a box full of lemons. <laughs> Very specific. Very specific. Do you remember? I do. I still have them in the box. In the box? Well, what am I supposed to do with them? I guess I string know, them, put them on a string. You could. You said you were saving them. I can... Uh... I can gift them to other people. To <laughs> re-gift them individually. <laughs> so yeah, the individual. individually. Or I can cut them open and like put something inside of it that's definitely not explosive and then seal it back up. You could. And then you could ship it, ship it back to me. Give me one. It's like payback. <laughs> yeah, but it would just be something cute like confetti is what I'm saying. Like, oh, yay! Confetti! Oh, or you could put... Yeah, you could put... That's what I'm talking about. Uh, you could put Bubba's boop in it and send it too. You could also do that. You know, I think I did that once in high school. I sent somebody, like, a cat litter. Is that legal? I feel like that's illegal. <laughs> people that... buy... People buy, co like, coyote urine and stuff on the internet. Uh, that's true, but I think that's for... Isn't that for, like, hunting purposes and, and not for... Yeah, well, chat... Don't get it mixed up. Yes, it's for um, territorial purposes. It's like if you have coyote problems, you can put that, you know, stuff everywhere and the coyote's gonna smell it and be like, ah, there's a more scary, bigger coyote here. I gotta get out of here. You can buy another animal's urine. Which one is it? Is it deer pee you can buy for this exact purpose? Probably. That sounds like a thing that people, yeah. Anyways.